what's going on guys it is mystical prime or you can just call me Taren whatever gets you cranked and today I am bringing you guys some Call of Duty Ghost cranked gameplay on the map tremor I'm using the AK-12 with the red dot silencer I'm gonna go 20 to 4 that's a pretty good score on cranked you know because these games actually don't last long at all when you play a cranked game in Call of Duty Ghost it goes by just like that like the game's done before you know so it's really fast paced and I go into pretty nice streaks in this gameplay, so I hope you guys do enjoy that. But today, guys, I'm going to talk about my first impressions of Call of Duty Ghost. And I'm just, I'm so excited to finally not play Black Ops 2 anymore. So my overall first impressions, guys, is that it's a great game. I really recommend, guys, that you go ahead and buy this game regardless of uh, the bad. Because I'm going to be talking about some of the things I dislike. But even though there are things I dislike, the, the majority of the things that I do like outweigh the dislikes. So... This game is a great game, but the first thing I do want to talk about, guys, is what I don't like about the games. I think that's what you guys really want to know about the most, is what's bad about Call of Duty Ghosts. You know, what makes or breaks the purchase of this game, and really nothing makes or breaks the purchase, but there are just a few annoying things about this game. So the first thing I want to talk about, guys, is the maps. The maps are really big. And this map, Tremor here, guys, I would say this is probably one of the smaller maps in the game, and, uh... But most of the maps, guys, are huge. Like, they're levels upon levels. And they're literally battlefield-sized maps. I'm not even joking. They're, they're freaking big. And I don't know who designed those maps because they're pretty bad for the most part. Like, my favorite maps so far are Strike Zone, Octane, and the map you're watching right now, which is Tremor. Uh, but there's some maps I just hate. And I don't even remember their names because they're that bad. Like, I just don't want to remember what they are. Like, every time I see the map, I just leave the lobby. Because it's a really, they're really big, and you'll see when you guys when you buy this game that those maps just they don't flow well at all. And I think those maps were designed for nine v nine ground war, but obviously this is be playing on the PS three at the moment, so it's just a six v six. So especially on those big maps, the game can go by really slowly. And also, guys, this game is a little bit more slower paced as well, so it's not going to be like Black Ops two or Modern for three where it's like everybody's in your face constantly with the spawns and everything. Uh, it's a lot more slower paced, unless you do play Cranked, which is one of the more faster paced game modes. But for the most part, you won't be dropping like 100 plus day in, day out like I do in Black Ops 2. Um, it's, I, I can barely get over 50 kills in this game. Uh, so it's it's quite tough. Uh, I've been trying to go for KM strike and stuff as the late and free for all, but my highest gun streak so far is in 19 gun streaks. Uh, so I'm getting close. I'm, I'm probably dropping KM today, hopefully. Uh, but let's talk about some of the things that I do like, guys, and that is the fact that the guns are really balanced. They're so balanced, it's it's insane. Like, there's not one gun that everybody uses. It's kind of like it's your own personal preference, which is great. You know, everybody can make their own classes. I think uh, so far I've used two assault rifles. The one right here, which is the AK-12, and the other one, I don't remember what it's called. It's the first one you unlock in the game, and they're both great assault rifles. It's basically just preference, guys. A lot of the assault rifles are really good. Uh, because of the health in this game, really, like, all the Sarvos to kill in, like, two to three bullets, which is great. And, uh, Assault Rifles are actually the most dominant, uh, piece of kit in this game. Most people are using the Assault Rifles because of the map sizes. So I recommend you guys go ahead and, uh, slap on an Assault Rifle instead of an SMG, just to let you guys know about that. And another thing I do like, guys, is the fact that the kill streaks are balanced. So there's no overpowered, um, Assault kill streaks. You know, they nerfed, uh, Specialist a little bit just to make it more balanced, because I have to admit, though, Specialist model for the was pretty much unbalanced is like god mode basically when you hit specialist bonus and monitor you got every single bird in the game and you were just god you were god but uh in this game uh the way they balance specialist is really great i don't want to go into too much detail on how they balance it you can go ahead and check it out when you do buy the game uh but this is the end of the cranked game guys i went ham 20 to 4 uh so i hope you guys do enjoy this video please let's try to hit 20 likes because this is the first day of call of duty ghost and guys um later on today i will be uploading my my best class setup video, so stay tuned for that. I'm gonna bring you guys a ton of Call of Duty Ghost uh, content for you today. I don't know how many videos I'm gonna be uploading, but I'm gonna be uploading quite a bit. So, yeah, let's try to get 20 likes for this video, guys, and comment down below Call of Duty Ghost is here if you watch the end of the video. But I'm Mystical Prime, or you can just call me Tan, and I will see you guys later today. Goodbye.